as fast as you think. On his best day, he flies on. But why the verse is telling <coughs> that the fly, you cannot take it? If he takes something from you, steals from you, you cannot take it. Why? It eats the food very quickly. Why we cannot take it back? Long at a mere five miles per hour. It flies five miles per hour, not very fast. Why we cannot take it uh, back or uh, take from the fly? Why? So, why is it so hard to swat a fly? Why we cannot swat a uh, fly? Why? It's telling in the verse, if it takes from you, still, you cannot take it back. Why? Why we cannot kill it tough like this? Why? It's because time moves more slowly for a time moves more little slowly. winged friend. This is what trying to swat a fly looks like to you. But this is what you look like to a fly. Come. Fly sees in slow motion. It's you, we are for him very slow. <laughs> Compared to us, flies see the world in slow motion. But they can perception depends on how rapidly an animal's nervous system processes sensory information. And it's measured in hertz. We see like this. Look what the fly sees. We see things at a rate of 60 hertz. 60 hertz, yani 60 pictures per second we see. But a common how the fly sees like these things. things at 250, 250 pictures a second. Hertz, taking in over four times as much visual information per second. Look, the insect, <laughs> he sees better than us, smells better than us. The insect. This allows, and we thought we call ourselves evolved. Allows the fly to react much quicker than a human. Within a. Okay. Here's how this video feels to a fly. The fly sees us like this. Some of them also see things in Matrix Bullet. I mean like Matrix, it sees, it sees the bullet. Time, whoa. The team measured a whole bunch. <laughs> the fly is like Matrix. Bunch of animals and their reaction times based on something called critical flicker fusion frequency. Basically, how their body responds to things like flashing lights. And it turns out the processing of information is tied to an animal's size and metabolic rate. Ah, this is it. Because if its metabolism is fast, because of this it thinks, it thinks very fast and time is slow for him. Because of this it's telling if it's still something digest, why it digests the food very fast. And you cannot take it back. It comes on your throat and take it, steal it very fast. Because its digestive system, metabolic system, is very fast. Because of this, the fly metabolism is very fast, it thinks very fast, and you are very slow for him. This is it. Great, you know how hard it is to swat a fly? That's because they take in seven times more visual and audio information per second than we do. The same goes for insects and small birds. Dogs take in information at twice the speed we do. Twice, but the most fast metabolism is the fly. Because this, the example it's giving in the verse, if it takes from you something, it steals the food, metabolic eats, and it take it, you cannot take it back. The metabolism and uh, the fastest, the uh, fly is the fastest. That's why you can't get your dog into... Look what it's telling you. The female typically makes dog and she considers, thus considers monogamous. Yani, the fly, it's not par parthogenesis. It needs a male. The male is the king of the fly. And remember what is telling about the fly. Zubaban. It's talking about a male fly. And the fly, they don't produce via parthogenesis woman. It produces, it needs a male, and the male is the controller. Luba, bang, there is no female. It's considered monogamous. God now will speak another subject. This is big subject now. We will start the big subjects. And the last subject is very strange and is very big. After this.
God is not timid to present an example. God is giving an example of a mosquito. Above it, but they translate it smaller than it. He's speaking about a female mosquito. And what is it above it? God is giving God is giving example of a mosquito. Why God is giving example of a mosquito? And it's layastahak. It's a big example this must be because of God is giving example of a female mosquito. We will check this. What is What is it about it? The superior features in the body of the... The mosquito is the most superior insect in the world. No, I think all the creatures, because you will God, soon, yeah. once again, be seeing how such a tiny creature as the mosquito is a great proof of creation. Color to form a hollow tube. The mosquito inserts this tube into the tissue it has cut and sucks up blood. Despite being very small, it acts as if it knew all about the systems in the human body. Uh, when it takes blood, it gives another medicine, non-clotting medicine it gives, so that it doesn't clot the blood, and it takes, and it gives anesthetics, it makes blood test too much things, we won't speak about this now. And injects a fluid. It, it has infrared, it has everything, uh, which is too much things, we won't speak about this. From one of the blades into the wound, this fluid numbs the tissue. Inject saliva to stop the blood from clotting. We know malaria, we know that they become mosquito, but uh, the only insect, the ant, it get infected with fungi and something, uh, the bees has antibiotic to defend. But the mosquito, <laughs> it doesn't get sick. <laughs> never it gets sick, never. Her infected saliva also carries a malaria parasite. If it's little sick and it's getting well and it bites us, it, ki it kills 100 million a year. One species only. Uh -huh. This year, 10% of people on Earth will be struck with malaria. Countless millions have been killed by it. Most... Parasite form that is deadly inside humans cannot survive a mosquito's stomach. The parasite that kills us, but it's dissolved in the stomach of the mosquito. It takes blood from every creature and it doesn't get sick because it dissolves the virus. It takes blood from every creature and it doesn't get sick. And when it's uh, get little sick and it's recovered and it, it bites us, it, we are dead quickly. And it's slowly digested. It's slowly digested in the stomach. It, it does, there is no sickness affects it. With the rest of her blood. The next time this mis bites a victim, the malaria parasite will ride in with her saliva and infect an Okay. We will see how. How? It has hemocytes, uh, white, white blood cells, there is uh, granulosis that we have very little, it has too much. It eats the, uh, in capsules, uh, all the viruses in capsules and it's digested. It has a special white blood cells. There is oxidative damage. It produces nitric oxide. Pyrosonitrate. You know what's pyrosonitrate? We use goldsmith hydrogen peroxide for cyanide. It makes hydrogen peroxide plus nitric together to, <laughs> to oxidate the virus. The mosquito produces nitric oxide, nitric, concentrated nitric, and hydrogen peroxide to kill the virus, it has another arsenal in its uh, baggage. First, white, white blood cells, oxidation with it, melanization. You know what is melanization? If it doesn't kill it with hydrogen peroxide and nitric oxide and the white blood cells, it has a special resin 
it, it traps it like a prison. It traps it like a resin in camp surrealist if it doesn't uh, kill it. It have it controls even special bacteria to eat them. And it, it doesn't get sick. It's, uh, there is no insect that has the most, and they are studying the mosquito, how it doesn't get sick. They studied, until now they found this, and there is more. One of the aspects biology considers is to fight infectious, they have considerable ability to fight infectious agents. They are studying this, how it's fighting these infections. The ants can't fight it, the, the spider gets sick, all the insects get sick, but the mosquito, it doesn't get sick. <laughs>